Continuing to talk about frozen shoulders. So we know that 80% of women in menopause will experience frozen shoulder of some sort. In 2019, researchers from Boston University published an article, this was the title, a surprising step toward melting away frozen shoulder. Study reveals a natural pregnancy hormone could relax a locked up joint. Okay, this is not surprising. We've come to expect great and formidable things from hormones. The hormone they were talking about was relaxin. Ever had a baby? You probably know about this one. But it's also worth noting that menopausal hormone therapy has also been shown to reduce the incidence of or relieve frozen shoulder. So that's hormone therapy. Now, how long does frozen shoulder typically last? About one to three years, which is a significant timeline, three years. Uh, maximum usually for most of us women there are lots of things we plan to do within a three-year period a 2022 study also found a very strong association between frozen shoulder and menopause and they also found interestingly which shoulder do you think would be more affected they found that it was the right shoulder and they found that the pain levels were very significant so in terms of ranking the pain levels most women were scoring a 7.6 out of 10 not a 3 not a 4 not a 2 7.6 out of 10